Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening to you all, ladies and gentlemen. I push the button, but the elevator won't come. Is it broken or something? Probably means it's broken. And welcome back to Silent Hill 3. You are here with Morris at the end of the last part. We were just in this lovely, lovely apartment complex. Office complex? Apartment complex. I don't know. Probably office complex. You know, maybe we're, maybe Heather's in the market. You know, she wants to rent out a space. Uh, for her sort of crime fighting techniques that she's honing as we speak. Um, can't really find anything suitable at the moment though. Um, so to sum up, I really have no fucking clue where we're going. I don't have a map of this area. Oh, that's the worst part. That's the worst part. Oh god, thank Christ that opened. Oh, this is gonna have a map. Come on, it's gotta do. There's nothing interesting on the poster though. Come on, hey, hello. I'd I'd buy that. I'd have one of them in my driveway. That doesn't sound so bad. I got a jack. Oh, I can open the door. Well, that'll do nicely. For reals though, kind of want a map. Kind of need a map. Just a bunch of serious looking papers on this desk. I don't need to take any with me. Well, that's nice. I don't think you need to point that out, but that's nice. Not sure how useful... Oh, God! That information's gonna... Be for me, for little old me over here. It's broken. It's broken also. God, they just fucking kickflip at you. Fucking 1080 nose bone. What? It's unlocked. Cool. Oh, that leads me back to here, for some reason. So now, well, I know what I can do, because the lift was open a little bit, so I can use the jack to open it fully, but... I feel bad not exploring that area a little bit more. Oops. Because I obviously need the elevator, and I assumed that I would go up. <laughs> but I really don't know. I'm just putting, I'm just, I'm, I'm just, you know, thinking out loud again. But this has got to be it. Yep. Yeah, if she tried, she could have probably gotten through that gap already, but whatever. Door downstairs looks open too. No way I can get down there like this. Dang it! I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need a rope. If only I had a rope, the snake would say. Should be able to use that rope I got. Ah, oh, if only I had a, if only I had a map. <laughs> that would really help. See my problem here though, because now I have no clue. Oh no, I have no clue where I am. Well, I know that I've not been in here before. Hello, madam. This is the only man who came with a head. There's something weird about the headless ones. Yeah, no, the headless ones. Those are the weird ones. Like, they can still see me or something. Ick. Oh, God. One of these is going to fucking move, and I don't know which one it is, but one of them's going to move. Here's a mannequin with no head or legs. I know it's just... I know it's just an inanimate object. But I'm still a little nervous. Afraid, maybe. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. I don't know what I just picked up, but I assume they were just more shotgun shells. Ah, oh, God. This box is filled with mannequin heads. I think I'll pass on this one. Ha, ha, ha. It's funny, it's funny, Heather. Fucking what? What? Why would it be decapitated? This is blood. Okay, nothing else to say about that, apparently. Fuck it, let's go. So mannequins are also a thing. How significant is that? No idea. I don't know whether there's uh, anything, any substance in that at all. 
It's difficult to see substance in mannequins because... What? How did I get back here? Fuck it. It's difficult to see substance in mannequins. Um, just because they're kind of like... Almost cliche scary, you know? Like, oh. Look at this creep. Even the Resident Evil 7 demo had mannequins in it. For seemingly no reason at all. I mean, I mentioned that... Um, a lot of the enemies in this game seem to be representing some kind of deformity with the body, which certainly, certainly missing a head is, is could, could perhaps be considered a deformity. Um, I don't know. Maybe it's linked to that, or maybe it's just some dumb thing that happened that's spooky. I don't know. I agree that there's more to these games than first meets the eye, but I also would concur that sometimes you can read too much into things. Um, this might be one of those times. Having said that, I need to find... I don't know, I need to find something that can get me down that elevator. A ceramic pot, not really my style. It's too big to use as a vase. Or a vase. As we would call it. Looks like there was a picture here before, only the caption's still around. Flame purifies all. Flame, eh? Well, I don't know what kind of picture used to be here, but I'm not too fond of fire. It's scary somehow. Well, being on fire certainly is. Not that that's ever happened to me, but... I feel the point stands. Its title is Repressor of Memories. What the hell kind of title is that? I don't get this picture at all. I knew there was a door there. Fuck, I nearly... I nearly gave up on that. Alright. Where the heck am I now? I got a screwdriver. It's broken. Okay, I don't know what I can use the screwdriver for. That's broken as well. That's where I came from. Wait, or is this where I came from? No, this is where I came from. Okay. So. That's not even a door. Alright. <laughs> I'm having a bit of trouble. It's locked. God, it's so fucking claustrophobic in here. Okay. So I just got a katana. It's a katana. But I don't need another one of those. I think one is plenty. Too much stuff will just slow me down. Okay, so apparently we're using this now. I feel like my uh, thing of the focus on melee is now justified. This is a short katana, about two feet long. Pretty powerful and easy to handle. Hard to please, but easy to handle. That's uh, <laughs> that's the best way. Okay. So, now I'm officially a samurai. Um, this game is about to get a lot more interesting. There are a bunch of paintings here. I don't know much about art, but I don't think any of these will be of use. It was so worth coming down here. I mean, I don't really know where to go from here, but... It was definitely worth it. That's a shame, I thought there'd be more in this room. Very much hoping for a bit of direction there. Alright, so I don't know what we've tried in here and what we haven't really. Tried that. Okay, that's was locked. That's, that's far out. Hey, hey, that's working. Not great, but it's working. Oh, now we're just trading blows. Ow, Jesus, feck. God. Combat is great in this. Wow. Damage. Inconsistent at best. Ugh, jeez. Okay. Well. I think that's a... A good day's work. Huh, okay. It's locked. Fuck, right. So there's no point to that. <laughs> Um, 
I've been in here, haven't I? Yes. Oh, God. Okay. This is tough. It's very disorientating when you come out of these rooms and you're facing a different way. You're going to have to bear with me on this one, guys. You'll notice that without a map... Ow. I am apparently powerless. Is there even any fucking point to this room? You know what? I'm gonna kill you because I feel like you wronged me by just being here. Not doing anything for you. Ah! Don't you get up. Nope, just gets up again. That's nice. Do these things die or not? I feel like that's a little uh, that's a little slim shady if they don't. I got shells. I got shells. It's fine. Don't you get up? I swear to Christ. That sounded pretty permanent. But there's no blood. No, that's definitely dead. Okay. So. No, there was not any point to this room. Shit on me. Don't. But that is... Oh, God, I don't believe that. That feels like there's something up there, but... Does not seem to want to work. All right, well, let's think about what we've got, then. Um, if we don't know where to go, we got to check the key items, and all we've got is a fucking screwdriver. Totally ordinary. Hmm, that's what worries me. Would you fucking reload it? Thank you. All right. Well, that was, uh few minutes of my life I'll never get back, but there you go. Okay, the question is what would the screwdriver be for? So what have we seen that the screwdriver might work with? And the answer is nothing. Nothing at all. As far as I can tell. Is it broken? Maybe I can use the screwdriver to fix it. Well, maybe I can't. There are cleaning goods here. There's not much I can do with them. Nope, I think that's fair. Ugh, maybe there's something down here. I don't know, did I go down to the bottom? Did I even check all the doors? I don't think I did. There may be a whole other floor here that I've just not looked at. Nope, that's where I fucking came from. Good. <laughs> oh, I'm bad at this. Okay, come on, guys. You got you got to give me a little bit of a break here. There is going... Ooh, dance studio. There is going to be a certain element of... I don't know where I'm going. And unfortunately, we just have to put up with that. But this looks kind of like progress. Fuck, what is happening? Wow, this ain't like no dance studio I ever been in. There's nothing. There's just nothing in here. What is the point of this? How am I supposed to perfect my moves in a place like that? Shit. Ah, alrighty. Well, that was interesting. The desk is all cluttered up. It doesn't look like there's anything I'm interested in. It worries me that there are so many doors with nothing in them. Like, that is really quite terrifying. Oh my god, it's there! Yay! Ah, it was on the very first floor we came through. Okay. Thought it was weird that we hadn't seen one yet. Desk is still all cluttered up. What is she looking at? Is she looking at the... What is she fucking looking Is it the drawer? 
Or is it something on there? It's the draw. The draw's open just a smidge. It must be rusted or something. I can't pull it out any further. Maybe I can jam it open or jimmy it open. Or jammy it open with this screwdriver. Oh, I got a rope. Yes, I don't have to go anywhere else. The desk is all still cluttered up. Son of a gun. All right, save that shit. Sweet. Okay. Number of saves, 14. Jeez. All right. Um, this is actually still a new area, so there might still be stuff. Oh, and I can check the map. Oh, I didn't even... Oh, you forget these things. Okay. Well, that's the last door in here. Oh, I love that. There's a huge arrow that says draw. That's nice. Health drink, health drink. Thank you. There's nothing of interest in the locker anymore. Because I've taken all the goodies. Oh, hello. So magazines here, but nothing really important. One of them I've already read, and the other just doesn't interest me. Which one do you think she's read? I don't know. You never know. Place your bets. Alright, so that was the health drink room. Alright, so we should just head back straight to the elevator then. Yosh. That'll do nicely. It looks sturdy and well used. What could it possibly be for? Oh, you want me to press X? <laughs> Waiting for it to jump out or something. Will you use the rope to get downstairs? Yes, I will. How tense. Well, I can't get back up now, can I? Ugh, what a bother to climb up the rope. I'm gonna... Ah, oh, I like that. I like how it's... It's not that she can't, it's that it's such a bother. Why do I even want it, really? Okay. Emergency staircase. Is that going to be locked? Yes, it is. Okay. What else do we get? Well, one of you is going to have to open. Well, it's not that one. I swear to God, what is this echo place? And why is it never open? Okay, what do we got? What do we got here? Is this the reception area? There are catalogs scattered around. What are you looking at, Heather? What do your LFIs see? Beef jerky. Of course they do. <laughs> uh, Heather only has eyes for beef jerky. Ooh, hello. A bathtub display. There's a dark red stain on the bottom. Very nice. Do you ever do that thing when you were a kid and you go, used to go to like DIY, well not DIY stores, well kind of DIY stores, but stores that had like, look at this sample bathroom and look at this sample kitchen. And I used to just go in and be like, this is my kitchen now, this, this is the kitchen that I, we should just get this kitchen. I could just live here. This, this store has everything I need. Just me? Okay. It's just used for display. It can't really be used. You should just pretend that it was like a giant house. But apparently only made up of kitchens and bathrooms. <laughs> uh, the occasional sofa. Well, time for a soak. I knew it. In the old bathtub. <laughs> oh, no. Why has it got to be this way? That's a fucking creepy effect. Don't tell me that killed me as well. No, there's no way. That would be dumb. 
wouldn't it? It's being invaded by the other world. Yep. The world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. No, not again. It's like when you wake up in uh, someone else's house Did she do this too? while you're at uh, while you're at university, and it's like some crazy bathroom that you've never seen before. <laughs> I like to keep things clean. A lot of people don't. All right, well let's see what's uh, let's see what's hanging around here. I'm twisting the handle, but nothing's coming out. Well, behave yourself, Heather. Okay, so we're still inside whatever the hell this place is. So that's something. Oh my. Things have changed. I got handgun bullets. That's not quite what I was after. The mummy-like thing in the wheelchair is just a doll. Or is it? Something about it makes me uneasy. Why, I wonder? I wonder why this would make me uneasy. That seems strange. Oh boy. Okay, well, I'm gonna have to play until I find another. Shit! Until I find another save point. Which is a shame, because I'm pretty. Uh, you know, I walked away from one like two minutes ago. This is the problem with these games. I can't save wherever I want. Look at that. Look at that yellow herb I should just be able to pick up. <laughs> I don't know what kind of plant this is, but it's withering away. Poor thing. It is a poor thing. It's not as poor as I am. Oh, <gasps> save point. Nice one. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna have to pause it for now, guys. Oh, there's something here. Maybe not. Find the Holy One. Kill her? Question mark? Maybe? Uh-oh. That's me. Who could have taken this photo? That's really creepy. That is creepy, Heather. Let's think about that while we look at this. But yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. Um... God, I'm loving this game so far. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll hope to see you all in the next part, guys. We are still not quite in the town of Silent Hill, which is weird. Anyway, I'll see you in the next part. See you later. I love the way she holds it. Like, it's kind of... I don't know, it's a... It's a it's a little bit more defensive, you know? It's not like I'm ready to battle you one-on-one -on -one with swords. It's kind of... I'd just pick this up randomly. Looks good. Anyway, yeah, I'll see you later, guys. <laughs>